Hey everybody, hope a wonderful day today. My name is Gold Code and welcome back to my channel. I know I haven't been posting anything lately since there's been a lot on my plate and had to deal with many things such as my writer's block of sorts. But then again, nobody really cares since I am a pathetic little channel with only 69 subscribers. Anyway, today as the title suggests, today we'll be looking at the top 5 best assault rifles in this game, Call of Duty World War 2. Last year, I tried to do something similar to this, but yeah, it was a huge flop as you can see for yourself, I am not an animator in any means necessary. So I decided to do things differently this year. The comparison format is the same, just the delivery of the information is different and hopefully better. Huge disclaimer, weapon stats on paper is very different than in practice. This information I am presenting you is an accumulation of statistics and comparing them with each other. Now that we have that out of the way, let's get started. For the number 5 spot, I was actually very surprised to see that the Goover took it. Or is it pronounced Goover? Goover? Whatever. There is definitely a learning curve when it comes to using this weapon, however if you take the time to master this gun, you will be decently surprised to what it can do. The Goover, Goover has the fastest fire rate from the semi-automatic rifles, and the second best recoil out of all the assault rifles, making a deadly accurate weapon in medium to longer ranges. In fact, it is so potent, it tied for third place in terms of overall points with the weapon we will be talking about next. For the number 4 spot is my favorite AR, the STG-44. The STG-44 is what you would call a jack of all trades and a master of none. It scored well in most departments and very poorly in others. The STG-44 has the second fastest fire rate with average damage and a pretty decent range. On the other hand, the weapon's recoil isn't awful per se, but it is one of the hardest to control out of all of the ARs. This weapon is a good choice in any situation, just not the best choice. For the number 3 spot stands the FG-42. Great weapon in terms of range, damage, and accuracy. Out of all the assault rifles in the game, the FG-42 has the best max damage range with 38 meters. On top of that, it has a mostly vertical recoil with minimal horizontal sway, making it an easy weapon to control and use. This allows the FG-42 to be the most consistent weapon out there, meaning the performance won't change much in varying ranges compared to other weapons. For the number 2 spot stands a bar with exceptional time to kill. Even though it may not have the highest damage or the fastest fire rate, it is definitely a force to be reckoned with. The bar has the second fastest potential time to kill out of all the assault rifles in both close and long range engagements. This makes the bar a deadly choice in any given situation. Finally, the moment we all have been waiting for. The assault rifle that holds the title as the overall best is the M1 Grand. The M1 Grand beats the bar by one point, however it is definitely a good weapon to use despite it just being a little hard to use. The M1 Grand has the highest damage out of all the assault rifle and has the fastest time to kill in close to medium ranges with 185 milliseconds. Combining that with great accuracy, the Ammo Grand is a high risk, high reward weapon that definitely deserves the number one spot. I understand some of you may be upset and would want to argue, therefore I put a link on the description below to my spreadsheet where you can see how I compared the stats and if you would like me to explain further on my thought process and evaluation, I can make a video on it. On the other hand, if you have any suggestions on how you can make my comparison process better, you can reach me on Twitter at, at goldkill underscore YT and message me your suggestions. All stats were provided by Brass Monkey in the Ultimate Utility app for Call of Duty World War II available in the App Store and Google Play Store. Thank you for watching and if you liked the video, please click on the like button down below and I'll catch you next time.